Hey guys, what's up? Chris here from BeerGeekNation.com. Today we are looking at the latest uh, barrel release from Stone Brewing. This is their Double Bastard in the Rye, coming in at 12.7% alcohol by volume. It is their double barrel ale. They throw in Templeton Rye whiskey barrels. I believe it's for about a year. Um, this got released at the same time as Southern Chard, which is their double barrel in bourbon barrel. Excuse me, double bastard ale in bourbon barrels. So this kind of goes hand in hand. It's cool because you can buy both of these right now, do a side by side, see what a whiskey barrel versus a bourbon barrel can do. So I'm a big fan of Double Bastard. I think their barrel program coming out of Stone has been really, really solid this last couple of years. So looking forward to this one. Let me get into the glass so you guys know it smells tasty. Give the final verdict on the bastard in the rye. Ah, oh, definitely Double Bastard. Super, super intensely malty. Caramel, dark fruits, vanilla. You get that whiskey spiciness definitely coming off this one. Oakiness, a little bit of char. Just an absolutely intense smelling beer. All right guys, the taste. Double bastard in the rye, cheers. Oh yeah, wow. Really is an assault on your mouth. Bitterness right at the front immediately taken over by massive maltiness that just coats the inside of your mouth. Caramel, chewy, like toffee, uh, dark fruits, plums, raisins, a little bit of hoppiness still in this one. You get a, a, like a bitterness, West Coast bitterness, grapefruit in there. Definitely getting the spicy kind of uh, whis rye whiskey characteristics, some oak, a little bit of vanilla, some toasted coconut in there, sweet in the aftertaste. Again, that, that, ooh, that spicy kind of whiskey is just kind of hanging out there. Vanilla, dark fruits, just again, just coating the palate. That big kind of just malty monster of a beer just coats the palate. The whiskey helps to kind of clear it out, but that bastard just kind of hangs out there. A really, really intense beer. All right, guys, so the final verdict in the stone, a double bastard in the ride. It's limited quantity, so if you find it, you probably want to pick it up. Guys, this one is getting an A. Everything I love about Double Bastard is in this one, but then they add that rye whiskey component, which I'm a big fan of rye whiskey. I, I love the spiciness from it, and I think it plays into the idea of Double Bastard really nice. It kind of cuts some of the maltiness, some of the sweetness, but you're still getting that toasted coconut, the vanilla, that big spicy whiskey flavor in there. It dries it out a little bit. Just awesome stuff. Super aggressive. It's a super intense beer. Just absolutely not like a first-timer's beer if they've never had Double Bastard. This isn't the one to start them with because it is very, very intense. Um, so getting an A for me, remember folks, life's too short. Drink amazing beers. Cheers.